hate that for me. I got every right how to talk, how I want to talk. Catch me on a flight down So it's been a minute since I've been shopping in general, but it's, I really want to get some Fashion Nova jeans again. Like I've been eyeballing some of them and I've actually purchased Fashion Nova jeans before. I actually made like a whole blog post that you can find on Google where I talk about my experience of uh, trying out Fashion Nova. I think it was in 2020 when I bought their jeans, but I pretty much gave it from the perspective of somebody who has a more thicker stomach versus someone who has a slimmer waist because let's be honest, let's be for real, most of Fashion Nova jeans are for people who have smaller waists, but I have seen people with thicker waists wear them too. I found a couple pairs that I want and most of them are cargo type of jeans so i think i might try to get some and then i'll share with you guys what i think just because i don't know i feel like it is so hard for me to find some jeans that fit me just because of the way my waist is built and how i have no hips almost it's just so crazy the way i'm built like i want to say i'm built bad <laughs> You know, it's just the way my body's shaped, it could be difficult for me to find jeans that actually fit the way I want them to fit. You know what I mean? And I hate that for me. I really do hate that for me because I want to be cute. Because jeans are pretty much my go-to for the most part. Or... They would be my go-to if I could find something that fit me right. But, yeah, like, they're pretty much my go-to. So, I don't know. Also, I should have recorded with my glasses off. Because I feel like I look better with my glasses off. My bun is real cute. Look at my gray hair, y'all. I can't stand it. I feel like I'm going to talk about this every video. I cannot stand my gray hair because it really be making, it's, it's giving haggy and old sometimes for me. Like if anybody watching this got gray hair, you know, I'm happy for you. But, <laughs> but for me, I cannot stand my gray hair just because it ages me so much. But then it's like when you can't see my gray hair, I either look my age or maybe a little younger. My eye has been watering all freaking day and I'm not sure why, but like it just keeps watering like right in the inner corner. Today I'm going to be trying, it's not really a new wig, it's an old wig that I bought that I never put on. I don't think I've ever tried this color before. I'm kind of concerned. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little concerned about how this color is going to turn out. But we going to see. We are going to see. See, look at how pretty it is. just flip the curls out a little I wish I would have got a different color I'm not gonna lie okay it's fine it's fine just trust the process see it looks so weird because on the camera it's giving wiggy but in person 
like it doesn't look that bad it really doesn't in person what am I about to do I feel like makeup would help me but I really don't want to put on any makeup right now So, I put on some eyeliner. I don't know if y'all can tell. I just put on my lower lid because that's what makes my eyes stand out a bit. But, and I did put on some mascara. I feel like if I put on maybe some false lashes, it would probably look better. Because for some reason, it looks cute in person, but the moment... It looks cute to me, but at the same time, it's giving baby doll. And I don't like that. I really don't. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I really don't. This is about to be a cosplay wig at this point. It really is, because it's not giving what I want it to give. It's really not giving what I wanted to give. <sighs> I don't know. What do y'all think? Cause this not it for me. But I want to wear it in more than one video. I don't know. It's just not it. Maybe if the roots were a bit longer, I probably wouldn't feel this way. And this is a half wig, I believe. Let me pull my glasses to see if it makes a difference. So now, I like it kind of on camera with my glasses, but I don't like it in person. What is wrong with me? <laughs> I just can't understand. I really don't understand what's going on here. The more that I look at it in person, the more it's given fake. Girl, <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, boy. I really don't. So these are some YouTube series that I'm currently thinking about making. Let me know if you guys would be interested in any of these. Okay, so this is my mini Target haul. I got these two platters from Target. They were really affordable. I'll leave the links down below. But yeah, I really like them. They're perfect for, you know, celebrations or whenever people come over. If you have a lot of food, I also plan on using these for a couple of mukbangs or just mukbangs in general. And you know what? I kind of want to ask y'all, do y'all like mukbangs, mukbangs where people talk in them? Or do y'all just like the chewing because i normally like to have conversations about relationships which you guys can quickly check out on my youtube channel because i do have some but i'm not sure if people are really interested in mukbangs or not since they're not as popular anymore If you like the Vampire Diaries too, feel free to check out my Vampire Diaries discussion playlist where I talk about a whole bunch of different things that I didn't like or did like about the show. It'll be linked in the description box below. So I made some homemade Bosco sticks and they look better the second time me making them. I'm proud of myself.
So today I'm going to be wearing a Pinterest outfit that I found that I thought was really cute. It's really simple, pretty much. It is a black graphic tee and some camel pants. I would say I'm going to wear the sunglasses, but I'm not just because it's snowing currently here in Michigan. Smoke slow, roll it up, count that, count that cash with smoke slow. 